Hello everybody, today we are going to be talking about mining altcoins and the first steps you need to take if you would like to start mining cryptocurrency. This will be a multi-video series starting with choosing your coin, then software, then hardware, followed by the basic setup for any miner. I will be making follow-up videos for more unique mining situations. Um, so before we get started, there is a link in the description below that explain with a video that explains how Bitcoin works. I highly advise you watch this video because it's vital to understanding Bitcoin and altcoins as a whole. Hello everybody, today we are going to be talking about mining altcoins and the first steps you need to take if you would like to start mining cryptocurrency. This will be a multi-video series starting with choosing your coin, then software, followed by hardware, ending with the basic setup for any miner. I will be making follow-up videos for more detailed unique mining situations. Before we get started, there is a link in the description below that you should check out. It explains how Bitcoin works. I highly advise we watch this video before we proceed because it's vital to understanding Bitcoin and altcoins as a whole. To get started, we are first going to talk about choosing your coin. Choosing your coin can be one of the most difficult parts about mining. Most people say, well, why don't you just mine Bitcoin? The answer is simple. Bitcoin is too expensive to start mining right now. It costs too much money up front, and like gold mining, it's the cost to start has higher now than it has ever been. With the constant fluctuating value of altcoins, even a small time miner can still be profitable if you're willing to put in the time to trade coins. There are a few things you need to look for when choosing your coin. One, what is the difficulty of your coin? The difficulty of your coin you're mining will determine how many mines you or how many coins you can mine. The lower the difficulty, the more coins you will receive. Number two, how popular is your coin? The popularity is important because if only a few people are following the coin, then only a few people will be looking to buy that coin. Three, how long has your coin existed? How long the coin existed varies greatly in importance depending on how you're looking to mine. There's a couple of different ways we can mine. Uh, one, you can look for a coin on the day of release for the easy coins and just hope it gets listed on the exchange. Two, you can research your coin and see how profitable it can be based on the community. There's, this is a much longer payout strategy, but the rewards can be much greater depending on the coin. In either case, I would still hold on to at least 100 coins because if the coin reaches Bitcoin level, that's still $62,000 you didn't have two years ago. Number four, how valuable is your coin? The level of value your coin has will determine that if you were to trade your coin now, how much you will get right now. If you hold on to your coins, you're likely to make more in the end if it's a good coin. Number five, are the devs still active? Lastly, this is the most important thing. If there are no more developers for the coin, then there's no reason you should continue mining. Unless there are other active members in the community that are looking to continue the project where it left off. The other things that show how serious a coin is, just pay attention to the coin's announcement page. Um, the, there is a link in the description below to bitcointalk.org. What you want to pay attention for is any coin starting with ANN in brackets. Well everybody, thanks for watching. Join me next time when we go over the software you will need to start mining. So thank you very much for watching. I'm going to try and make more of these videos more often because I definitely want more people involved in cryptocurrency because the more people that are involved, the more likely it's actually going to become a real thing. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and you have a great rest of your week.